Today's vlog brought to you by Jack Link's Beef Jerky Chew, the original Beef Jerky Chew. <laughs> There you are guys, what's going on? It's Moostango 9 or Sean here, and I got a new vlog for you today. It is Monday, so uh, there's a lot of catching up to do from this past weekend. We had a busy, busy weekend. I guess you could say a busy, busy Saturday, because Sunday we really just hung out at the house and, and slept all day and watched movies. We had a little bit of an ice storm here, and it held all evening long, and it was really cold, so we stayed inside, lit a fire. Wife made some delicious spaghetti, and we had a good time hanging out. Saturday started and woke up and went fishing with my little brother and I have footage of that so I'll put that in sometime around here look I start the day off Meow. Hunter, Hunter, Hunter. Yeah, that dude's a fighter. Keep showing him. And I caught three bass there, three, three bass there. He caught zero, and he's the fishing pro out of the family, but somehow, I caught all the bass. Oh well. It was a good day fishing. We did that and then uh, went home, met up with the wife, and went to Cowboy Stadium. AT&T paid millions and millions of dollars to be able to call it AT&T Stadium. So we better call it AT&T Stadium. Hold on, I'm gonna wait because this is a busy highway and I don't want to die from the cross traffic. Let's go again. We made it. We're alive. Woo! 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 PBR was out there. If you don't know what PBR is, that's uh, professional bull riding. They had the Iron Cowboy number five event or something like that. And if you remember from my last vlog, I mentioned Justin Moore was going to be out there, and I was really excited about that. And Justin Moore killed it, man. Such a great concert. It wasn't very long lived, it was about 45, 30 minutes long. So. Not the longest of concerts, but hey, it was uh, leading up to an awesome show of what was going to be PBR. So we gotta watch the bull riding. And I'm actually gonna change this because the sun is, there we go. We're not so blown out anymore. So two different bull riding spots and we had booths at either side so we could walk back and forth when they were riding on this side and they weren't riding on this side. And those bulls are huge. They are ginormous animals. And you could see them right in front of us and they were just, like right there and at one point a rider got thrown off right in front of where my wife was standing and she was like freaking out she was like oh my god like the bull's right there blah 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 and it was so true the bull was right there and you could see where he had dug his feet in the ground to kick back up and throw that guy off of there and it was no joke a foot right in front of us so it was wild it was a really really fun time and i have never experienced anything like that at all i've even been to rodeos and new guys in the rodeos back in college and 
this stuff was even crazier. I mean, you're in this huge stadium. This is where the football players come out, is where we came out. And we're standing on where the field would be, and it's all dirt because they're having the bulls. And you get to look up and see all the people in the stands, and it was amazing. It was just so cool. I would love to hear what you guys did on your weekend. I know a couple of people I know went to Cars and Coffee Dallas and they had a blast out there. They said that was the best Cars and Coffee of Dallas has ever been. Uh, a couple of my buddies went down to Houston and they went to the Houston Cars and Coffee and then they had a cruise afterwards with the Stangs of Houston. And uh, I'm super jealous I didn't get to go to that. Uh, I just know how, how Houston is and like, their car scene down there, especially the Mustangs, is so intense. And they got a lot of them. I think they cruise with like 55 Stangs, which is incredible. That would have been an awesome video to make. Now, I do have a Facebook page now. So if you go to facebook.com slash Mustang09, I feel kind of weird because it says entertainer on there. And I want to entertain you guys, but I didn't want to create just a whole nother personal account. I still use the one I use with my wife and I, but uh, Go on there and we can have feedback with each other. We can talk back and forth. You can leave me ideas. I would love to hear ideas from you guys on, on what you want to see from me next. Hopefully this vlog produces and this channel keeps growing and it's what you guys want to see and keep coming back to. So sorry for the shaky camera. We're on these sketchy back roads out here. But as always guys, thanks so much for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing to my channel. It is much appreciated and it makes my day. So we'll see you guys later and look for a second video this week as I'll be putting out number two like you requested. So see you guys later. Thanks for watching.